So this is Ivy, a smart planner that can not only take very good care of your plants, but also turn it into an adorable pet with emotions and its daily life. In this video, I'll walk through some of its core features, including smart planning, interaction system, and behavior engine. It should be noted that even though the hardware and the overall design has already been freezed, the software development is still at around 50% in its progress. So the features shown in the video should be seen as a proof of concept and are mostly not refined to meet, to meet the standard of the final delivered version. Also, what, I'm hold, uh, what we are talk, seeing here is a 3D printed prototype. Its appearance is not as polished as the final mass produced products. And now let's talk about smart planning. What we want to achieve is a trouble-free, smooth, and interesting experience to planning with Ivy. To put it simply, Ivy will firstly read data from its various sensors, compare, compare it with the optimal data set, find out what it needs, and use its ex expressions to alert or to guide you. If Ivy has trouble with the process, it will ask the cloud server for help, where it can have access to a planning database and various AI algorithms we built over the year. To give an example, if I block its light sensor for a while, Ivy will have this, uh, this expression seeing that it's too dark out there. Now if we lift the inner pod, we'll set Ivy in the absence mode and we can see that from the inside, Ivy has a large reservoir that can hold about 120 milliliters of water which is enough for four to seven days. After filling up the water, Ivy will then drink automatically from uh, via its uh, sub-irrigation system. And we can also see from the inside, there is a solute moisture sensor, a water presence sensor, also a water level sensor. Right now there is no water, so if I so if I put the plant back it will try to tell you that it needs water. Now let's fill some water.
And now it just starts to drink from the water. In future releases, Ivy will also guide you to fill the reservoir in a specific frequency and each time with a specific amount of water and according to the type of the plant and the readings from its environment sensors. Speaking of environment sensors, well, let me put out the water first. It has a light sensor, ambient light sensor here. And down the bottom, there is a temperature sensor and a humidity sensor. We also have a vibration sensor down here for the purpose of interactions. From this page, you can see the real-time data feedback from Ivy. Also from Ivy's uh, app, you can also see the real-time data. Now let's just put it back. Here the app shows the plant is back. In future releases, with your permission, Ivy might also be able to exchange data with your purifier, air purifier, or any other IoT devices that you have in your home.